okay now we have created customer master data here one and two and we have also created vendor master data one and two the next step is to create bank master data and asset master data but let's not do it now because we can do this when we go to the respective modules I need to go to the business transactions session we have general ledger and account receivable accounts payable so forth we start with general ledger we need to post some business transactions in the respective module in general ledger we have two business transactions here in this tutorial example the first one is already done initial jail balances posting as per the balance sheet on 1st of january remember we did this by posting this and we also saw the financial statement version where these figures are reflected okay this is already done this is already done uh, we do this transfer hundred dollars from bank to cash in hand from bank account we're going to transfer hundred dollars to cash in hand account this is petty cash it's also called as petty cash so this normally happens in a company whereby they will keep some petty cash in the office so that we can pay for petty expenses so as and when the petty cash depletes they will transfer money from the bank to a cash in hand account so we normally do this this is a typical general posting we normally do this using general posting screen the t code is fb50 and the menu path is this let's do it now oops go right accounting financial accounting general ledger posting enter gl account document is the one okay this one corresponds to this menu path here mm -hmm. now double click this company code is test let's choose our company code change company code edit change company code put sun now it's defaulted to sun choose the document date F4 function key F4 F2 so that it selects the current date now the GL account GL account is cash in bank this one should be credit by 100 and the cash in hand should be debited by the same amount cash in hand debit by 100 simple as that simulate yeah I will ask for the additional date here double click and you come to D on remember this is not a required step you can just put the current date as a due on it's not really applicable for this transaction but just to cheat the system just put in a date it doesn't really matter what date you put okay this field if you press F1 here you see the baseline date for due date calculation this date is uh, used only in uh, AR invoice and AP invoice where the due date has to be calculated for the respective invoices for general posting doesn't really make sense so just simply put any date and so as this let's put a date go back and simulate you have 100 deducted from cash in bank and 100 debited and cash in hand just post it and it's done see this thing is posted you can display again yep we have done this transaction as simple as that so let us check our financial statement version go here go here go here go here where's closing periodic processing closing and uh, sorry not here it is uh, in the reporting information systems balance sheet channel ledger actual comparison mm -hmm. 
Sun Sun and execute see the cash in hand has been increased by two thousand has been increased by hundred dollars to two thousand cash in bank is reduced by hundred from the earlier eight thousand is reduced down to seven thousand nine okay there is one more report where you can see the jail balances let me show you financial accounting general ledger account display change line items remember this report is very important you just choose the cash in bank company code sun all items just choose this all items no line item display possible all right so Let me just show this and here display change. Mm -hmm. This one, all items. It's loading you know why just now the system threw an error message because I was using the old report in ECC 6.0 we have introduced a new GL concept and therefore you have to use only new GL reports to access the GL account balances see the earlier balance of this cash in bank is 8000 since we have credited 100 see this transaction it's a document number this, our, this document number belongs to the initial balance sheet upload just double click this it will show you the details of the document ok if not I just zoom it here and press this see it takes you to the source document from which the posting was made you see this 8000 cash in bank was made this when we posted this document this document can you recognize this document this is the first ever document that we posted to post the GL balances from the balance sheet I show you how to go here again just point here and point this glasses sign and I'll get this and then you press overview this one is showing only that particular line item but if you want to see the entire document just press this you can see the entire document okay, if I double click I'll go to the line item All right once again you go here press this see the particular line item 8000 when I go to the overview I see the all the other line items in the same document and I can go to a particular line item and go back here see item now this one this is the cash transfer document that we posted similarly I can zoom in zoom in here I see the whole document just press the overview see I can retrieve back the document all right so just remember to use this report not this one because in ECC 6.0 only this will work because of the new GL concept you see this word here new in fact in many other uh, what you call steps you see this new uh, 
what you call that remark so just choose a new if you are using ec6.0 if you are using other versions like sap 4.6c then you won't see this remark new you will see only this in those cases you can choose this but for the newer versions like ec5.0 and 6.0 please use this if you use this you will get an error message like what i got just now see this better not use it okay now cash in hand let's check cash in hand mm -hmm. choose all items you see 2100 this is posted from the initial balances upload 2000 and this one is a transfer that we made all right we have done with this with this postings we go to next topics which is accounts receivable module where we can see the AR sales and all that